Welcome back. We are here looking at the indices, and this is going to be my daily forecast for Wednesday, June 9, 2021. If you like to support the channel, welcome. You are welcome to hit the subscribe button down here in the corner, hit the like button, the bell button to see our new videos, and we'll start by looking at the SP 500. And yes, there it has gone back and forward today, but not a lot of movement. So um, at this current stage, we're technically just trending sideways, and we have been trending sideways for the last uh, nearly three weeks. If you look at technical indicators, they are also fairly flat. The MACD is uh, still above the signal line. It is still bullish. The, um, the stochastic is bullish. CCI is also bullish territory, but it's turning around here. And the RSI is flat. So if we were to break down, then the 20 exponential at uh, give or take 4,200 should offer support. The 50 moving average down here at the 4,158 should also offer support, and 4,000 should definitely be absolutely the mark of bottom of this market. Long term target here, or medium term target, should be around 4,400. So let's look at the Dow Jones. So very similar here in Dow Jones, it did break down towards the 20 exponential and then bounce. So that's a very encouraging sign for the Dow Jones that it continues to bounce off the 20 exponential when we get closer. So this is a very in a bullish candlestick. If you look at technical indicators, they are also fairly flat. MACD flat, CCI is flat, so sarcastic still bullish territory, but it's turning around. And the RSI is kind of is also flat at this point. If we rally from here, they will most likely run into resistance at the 34,924. So let's look at the NASDAQ. So NASDAQ did rally up towards 13,911 and then gave most of those gains back. And now we're trading at 13,814. If you look at technical indicators, they are still fairly bullish. MACD is bullish, stochastic is bullish, CGI is bullish, and the RSI is flat at this point. If we were to break down, then the 50 at the 13,631 and the middle of the bullish band should offer massive support. 13,500, give or take, should be um, where we bounce from here if we basically break down. We have tested it and uh, therefore it's fairly unlikely that we'll retest it all uh, right away at this point. It's more likely that we will continue grinding higher uh, until we get towards 14,000 and beyond that. So let's look at the German DAX. So German DAX continues to grind higher and now it looks like we're running out of momentum. We could see this pullback towards support of roughly 15,480. If you look at technical English, we can see that the MACD is turning around here, becoming very flat, so probably going to cross the signal line. Stochastic is crossing the signal line, CCI is bullish, and the RSI is technically flat. So we have been rallying for quite some time, and now it kind of looks like we are going to pull back towards the 20 exponential before continuing higher. So let's look at the UK 100. So it uh, went all the way up towards 7,110, uh, where it closed. And if you look at technical indicators, we can see the MACD is flat, stochastic is bullish, TCI is bullish, and the RSI is bullish as well. We are hitting the top of the Bollinger Band. So at this point, we could be we could expect a pullback. Otherwise, uh, 7,200 should be the next target here. So let's look at the China 50. So China 50 has a pullback all the way down towards the middle of the bullish band and the bounce from there. We're still down today. Technical indicators are looking dreadful. So we, if we were to break below the middle of the bullish band, then we have the 50 down here at 17,389 and the 200 moving average at roughly 17,000. The 200 moving average offered a massive support the last time. We can see it right here and also here. So um, we could expect this to bounce from the 200 moving average. Otherwise, if we manage to take out these previous highs here, then we are looking at 19,000. So I hope you find this helpful. You're welcome to support the channel by subscribing. Hit the like button and the bell button to see our new videos. And good luck and thank you very much.